today we're in uh, Victoria, Canada, on board Radiance of the Seas. Uh, she's undertaking a uh, $19 million rebite as part of the Royal Advantage program. This revitalization is going to be in total 20 days, very heavily focused on our hotel and guest areas. The ship is going to be enhanced in so many different areas. We have really taken opportunity here with Radiance to um, uh, introduce you know, many of our new venues um, like Rita's Cantina, uh, Izumi, uh, the Park Cafe, the Boardwalk Doghouse, Giovanni's Table, Summer Grill and the Chef's Table. We are actually now referring to Radiance as the culinary ship in our fleet because she is going to get an exhaustive menu of so many new food and beverage offerings. We're touching all the public spaces on the vessel and we're doing work in every single cabin and also adding uh, 15 new staterooms. The Azipod work was the, the biggest work. Then we had uh, stabilizers, there's one on each side, and we had some flap repairs that had to be done on those. We have three thrusters up forward that had to be uh, completely rebuilt with all new seals and everything. We'll have anywhere between seven to 800 people on board this ship uh, undertaking work at any one time, as well as the, the crew members that we have. We take a lot of time in preparation. We have a task list. We actually sit down with the contractors and go task by task, literally screw by screw, if you, if you know what I mean. I'm actually amazed at what can be done in 21 days when you think about everything that's happening on board. I am very proud. I'm very proud of the Radiance, what, uh, what she's going to look like. It's extremely exciting to look forward to what we have to bring into the market again. There's something that we will be extremely proud of.